Hello. Welcome to Confusion and Delay. Why? It's the confusion and I'm the delay. Well, we're filming again. Stop being rude. <laughs> Welcome back to another episode of season four and it's Bologna. I don't remember. together. Nancy is a conductor's daughter. Like One day she was working daughter? on Scarloe with some polish and a rag. Scarloe was snoozing you know, happily, but Nancy wanted to talk. Snooze. Wake up, lazy it's bones. Like Your Nancy brass is filthy. Aren't you ashamed? Whoa! No, yawned Scarloe. You're just an old fuss pot. He has no control over what he looks like. He can't He was thinking himself. about his friend Renee yeah, she's ugly and all the good away, times like, he could share before Renee went away to her no. Renee's has a stretchy face. Daddy told me. I'm no. going now, she said. Nancy, stop. Is, Do I really look nice? Is this some random photo before the brother of the train? Now like, I don't understand. Now who's an old fuss pot, laughed Nancy, and Listen, set to work once more. coming home. It's a big deal. Brother. Duncan. But I'm not even polished. Of course, this not wasn't true. Like but guy. Duncan and George... Ah! He became sulkier still. Get gone. You know what show you're watching. There was bad news. Bad news. One of Scarlowe's coaches yeah. has come off the rails, called Duncan's driver. Ah, this extra work, rumbled Duncan. It wears an engine out. <sighs> Rubbish. It's your come job. On. But it hurts so much to move. The derailed coach was in the middle of Scarlet. What's interesting to me is like they let some of these trains get away with coach. so much. And those trains are not turning a generator to break down into work straight into the side. So let the workers sort out the man. I don't know why he's so angry about this. He's so coaches all the like way. I get no rest. I get no rest. He must He literally woke up and did nothing. Keep our passengers waiting, said his driver. Duncan was cross. You always think about the passengers and never about me. Why is he so entitled? Like, it wasn't long before Duncan built up enough steam to you said to do absolutely again. nothing forever. Like, sounds like a Duncan. I'm over such a disappointment. Like, Duncan Donuts, too. Like, never At have a star. They reached the viaduct near the station. Then Duncan was very rude. I know, that. right? Scarlowe had to haul Duncan and his train all the way to the platform. God, sometimes I wish I could just drag my unwilling co-workers around. Just grab them and you know where you're going. Yeah. The passengers were few. That night, Sir Topham had spoke to Duncan. No passengers Stop. means no polish. And no polish means no passengers, Duncan muttered to himself. He still has a lot to learn, doesn't he? Argument? Like, he just kind of went, no, and he went, know yourself. Yeah. And then that's it. Like, that's the, that's very much the you can't fire me, I quit motto. I'm mean, just like, I don't understand what, yeah. Well, Not like he can go do another job. Well, that's really what it is. And you're like, do you feel pity for Duncan? Not really. Do I feel pity for Duncan? Not really. Uh, comment below. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, support us on Patreon. We'll see you next week with a new video for this series.